Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Elena and in today's video I would like to share 7 Hoyas that's pleasantly surprised me recently. <laughs> As you know, a lot of Hoyas kind of don't grow for a while. It takes some time to acclimate to your home and start growing. And this guy's kind of surprised me. Let me start off by saying all of the Hoyas that I'm showing you today, they all live in my grow tent. It does have perfect environment for them. I do have a heater in there. I have a fountain in there for humidity. I have fans. I have two large full spectrum grow lights in there. So obviously they are living in the perfect conditions. So keep that in mind. But even in the perfect condition like that, not all of my Hoyas take off right away. Some of them just sit and sit and do nothing. But these ones really, really kind of took off and I wanna share with you guys today. So let me start off with Hoya number one, which is species 851 Heartleaf Silver Spot. That's the way I purchased it. That's the way I'm gonna call it. <laughs> so, but this one right here, it's only have two leaves for now and I believe only this leaf actually grew in my care but let me show you the stem that just took off it is very very long all the way to the top then this trellis they're not really small so that just happened so fast with this Hoya all of a sudden it just took off for me and I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see, but there is new leaves are starting up right there. So hopefully very soon, I will have a lot of new leaves on this very, very long vine at this point. Hoya number two is my Hoya Finland Sonii. That one kind of surprised me also. I had only to leave for quite some time and then it just took off again. These are not a small trellis. And as you could tell, like how many leaves I've gotten just recently, I mean, it just took off. Also very, very long vine. There's a baby leaf right there. So cute. So all of these leaves happened literally within the past month. And the vine goes all the way up to here, almost to the top of the trellis. So this one just took off for me also. I'm very, very pleased. I love this Hoya. I love the foliage on it. It just, the veining is absolutely gorgeous. And the next Hoya I have is Hoya Coronaria Red. I bought this Hoya a while ago. It was this little, as you could tell, this little stump right here. That's how little that Hoya was. It had just one leaf, which I think I already lost it. All of this is also happened with the last maybe months and a half, two months. I mean, it just took off. You could tell the whole trail is basically looping around and going this way. So it's, and it's growing a lot of new leaves. Hopefully this whole vine will be covered in leaves pretty soon and hopefully maybe even blooms this year. That would be absolutely amazing. And the Hoya number four I have is Encrisada Moonshadow. You guys have seen it before. I showed it few times in my videos. It's getting a lot of leaves. When I purchased it, it only had two leaves. I believe this one and this one right here. And then it's grew quite a bit more and it's keep on going. Also, this vine grew all the way to the top of the trellis right here. And there is a tiny, tiny new leaf right there. So beautiful leaves, the variegation on it, it seems like it, they come out green and after a while the variegation starting to appear on it. Very, very happy with this. It's finally took off and it's getting pretty, pretty long, you guys. I mean, I don't even know how to show it, but it's pretty good sized trellis and it's a pretty good sized plant at this point. So hoping maybe for some blooms this year also. Next Hoya I have is so cute, you guys. It's Hoya Chuniana. Although it did not grow as long as the vine as the other plants, but it still grew quite a bit for me. It's in my care. This plant grew these two leaves right here. And it's starting these two new leaves. And I really wanted to show you guys those. They are so beautiful. 
I love the color of it and when they come out they come out almost black in the beginning and then they progressively turn more red and then they become this very neon green color very very pretty Hoya and as far as I know a lot of leaves can have imperfection but so far it's doing well for me and I have pretty perfect leaves so again this is Hoya Tuniana super super cute and the last two Hoyas I would like to share with you guys I am so excited these are two Hoyas you have seen in my video she's finally here it's from plant nurse on Etsy and it hasn't been that long since I purchased those plants and I'm kind of surprised how fast they took off which is very unusual for Hoyas they took off pretty much right away the minute I purchased them and they're doing pretty good I mean they didn't grow as much as the other ones but they still growing pretty fast I mean it, they, it took no time for them to acclimate whatsoever and one of them is Hoya Kalina right here look at those leaves so pretty I mean look how much it grew you guys when I got this plant it only came with two leaves now it has quite a few and the color on those leaves is absolutely beautiful you guys they come out pretty red and eventually they do turn green but that red is absolutely beautiful on it and the last one is my Hoya elliptica as you guys know I have tried to purchase this plant three times and the third time finally I was able to get it if you remember it came with just two leaves and it's already grew me three new leaves which I was very surprised because as far as I know it's not an easy Hoya to ship it's not an easy Hoya to grow but so far it's doing so well again took off almost immediately after I purchased it and um, grew me three beautiful leaves and you could tell it's very very happy in my grow tent it does like the lighting there it's getting very very splashy these two leaves are brand new so they're still very very soft and they're a little bit lighter in color this leaf is a little bit older and that's why it's a darker color and I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it but I have a feeling right here that tiny tiny little knob it looks to me that we might be getting a peduncle you guys <laughs> So it's hard to tell still because it's very very tiny but it does look to me I even looked with magnifying glass and it looks to me that it might be a peduncle forming there so we'll see I don't know I will update you if that's the case that would be pretty amazing if something this little would bloom for me although I did had experience with my other Hoyas in my grow tent that bloomed while they were still rooting which is kind of crazy I mean they were still babies and they would bloom for me and I posted on my social media some of you guys might have seen it it would be pretty cool if this one does it too which is would be very very nice surprise so these are basically seven Hoyas that made me very very happy recently and I did needed that happiness so that was so nice to discover all this new growth after quite some time not really paying as much attention to my plants since we did had some unfortunate events in my family that we had to go through so we had a pretty rough months it was definitely a pleasant surprise to find all this beautiful new growth and beautiful leaves and vines and all that stuff so I'm definitely getting back into enjoying my plants paying more attention to them and um, really enjoying all of this this is so beautiful and sometimes this hobby can be overwhelming and exhausting at the same time it's so rewarding and makes you so happy so you guys don't be discouraged if your hoyas don't grow for a while if they're just sitting there not doing anything one of those days they just gonna take off and once they do I promise you there is no stopping for them that's all I got for you guys today I hope you enjoyed all of this new growth and all this beautiful new leaves if you like this video make sure to give it a like so YouTube promotes this video to other plant people don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you guys want to see more of my videos check them out right here right here and right here I have quite a few videos at this point I will see you guys in those videos if not I will see you next Thursday at 11 a.m. thank you so much for watching and happy growing bye guys